with a video called Collateral Murder. It depicts a US Army helicopter opening fire on a group of people in Baghdad, including two Reuters journalists. The US military initially claimed that the individuals in the group were armed insurgents, but the video showed that most of them were unarmed civilians. The leaked footage also exposed the cruelty of the pilots treating the shooting like a video game. For years, US officials claimed that the Iraqis had been killed in a firefight. But it was only after WikiLeaks published the video three years later that the government's narrative unraveled. The release of Collateral Murder was a significant moment in the history of investigative reporting and whistleblowing, and demonstrated the power of independent journalism in holding governments and institutions accountable and revealing their lies. These publications were a game changer. This really opened the eyes of the public to what was going on. A military investigation cleared the pilots involved in the attack. The only people who faced any charges were those who leaked and published the video. It was shocking and eye-opening for the public to get this never-before-granted insight into how war is actually waged.